Hello, my name is Luis Reina, and I guess you're here because you want to learn about data and analytics. Let me explain you in this short video what is analytics. Companies has realized in the last years that the most valuable asset in the company is data. This is why data is key in digital transformation. This is why data scientists and business analysts are so important today in companies. So data we know is the most valuable asset of the company. And this is why companies want to be data driven. A data driven company is such a company that every employee in the company is going to use data and analytics to take their decision from the CEO to the last employee is using data instead of using uh, intuition, experience to take their decision. Okay, so the question is, well, we all know what is data, but the question is, what is analytics? Okay, at this time, you might stop the video and think, what is for you analytics? I'm going to give you my definition that hope that helps, but answer yourself this question. You have to answer what is analytics, what would you answer? Okay, so for me, analytics is the process of transforming data. This is cleaning, transforming, twisting data, putting data upside down, doing anything with the data. To what? To get insights, to get knowledge, to be able to make better decisions. Okay? So at the end, analytics is you're going to do things with the data. You're going to and we will learn through this kind of master what is the things you can do with the data but at the end this transforming data will give me knowledge will give me insights that's going to help me to make better decisions okay so this is a good high definition of what is analytics doing things with my data to get insights to be able to get good decisions for my company and what is the outcome of a good data analytics? If I do good analytics, that is not easy. We're going to learn that doing good analytics is not easy because we have many issues with the data that we will learn. But if I do a good, okay, good analytics that, is, that we will learn that is not easy, what is the outcome? What are you going to get? At this point, you may answer, okay, I'm going to make more money for my company. Okay, that could be fine. But what if you are a non profitable profitable organization you are the police and you want to find the bad guys okay so we want to have a more generic or high level definition outcome of a good data analytics that I say is not simple thing improve your business if you are a profitable company you can get more revenue you're gonna get more profit but if you are uh, a non-profit organization you're gonna make your business better you're gonna find the bad guys if you're the police okay you're gonna find fraud okay you're gonna improve at the end of the business so doing a good analytics as again we will learn that it's not so easy is the the outcome is okay we're gonna have a better business if your analytics does not improve your business it's a bad analytics and today companies do a lot of analytics that is not good because at the end they do things with the data remember the definition doing things with the data to get insights but then at the end if it doesn't improve your business is useless so you have to think that good analytics always improves your business so I want to finish with this definition of analytics the process of transforming data doing many things with the data that we will learn as I said to get knowledge to get insights in order to make, make better decisions to improve your company